All right, now for the latest liberal lunacy, Senator Bernie Sanders, yes, the commie socialist from uh, Vermont, introduced the bill. It would establish a 32-hour work week without any reduction in pay. How generous of him. Problem is, this would likely hurt a lot of small businesses. We'll have more on that in a moment. Meanwhile, out in the great state of California, lawmakers there are proposing a surcharge on electricity bills based off your income instead of usage. Oh, I thought we treat people equally, meaning the more you make, the more you're going to pay for the same exact energy. Joining us now, he's the host of Kudlow on the Fox Business Network. Larry Kudlow is with us. All right. So I'm reading this and I'm like looking, looking at this. Uh, they already have the highest paid, uh, the, the highest income taxes in the country out in California. Uh, you see business after business after business leaving California, their headquarters, and you can't blame them. Why don't they just say, all of you people that make money and create jobs, get out of our state? Because that's ostensibly what they're, they're doing anyway. Yeah, give it. Yeah, give us your money. Give us your money. I mean, what's so wonderful about this um, California thing is it, it's not even tied to electricity use. It's just an inco it's an income tax increase. And by the way, yes, the upper end pays more. But the stupid part of this, and this is where there's going to be revolt, you look at the numbers here, Sean, the middle class is going to be charged significantly. I, I did the math here. The middle class right now pays about 3200 bucks a year for their electricity bills. That, by the way, is at the highest in the nation. This would add about 1200 bucks. It, whether you consume more or less electricity, it's going to go on your bill. It's almost a one-third increase on the middle class. And, yeah, up the income ladder, it pays more. This just... It's not, it's not a carbon tax. It has nothing to do with reducing. In fact, energy use may go up under this thing in certain cases. And the whole problem in California is they don't have enough electricity because renewables don't work. They're not sustainable. They break down. They're very expensive. They should use oil, which they have a lot of. They should use natural gas. They could use coal. They could use nuclear power, but they don't. So they don't. You can't plug in your car if you have an EV, electric vehicle. You can't plug it in because there are always brownouts and blackouts of electricity. This thing is just a dumb middle class tax hike in California. That's all it is. And then when they tax corporations and then they sue corporations like the sue and oil companies, who pays the bill uh, for those expensive law firms that have to defend themselves? Wouldn't that be the consumer, Larry? You're, you're the expert. Yeah. Yeah. No, no, no. That stuff gets passed along uh, all the time. And by the way, the, you know, they're going to start losing stuff in the courts. I mean, they're not these mandates that California is making up. Um, they have never been adjudicated. There are no congressional laws. The state legislature may or may not pass this thing. From what I gather, there's a tax revolt going on. Look, this is dumb, and the Bernie Sanders 32-hour work week is dumber, or as dumb, because there you've got, let's not work, okay? O already, the participation rate uh, among uh, prime workers is uh, at an all-time low. Yeah. There's probably 10 million people outside the workforce that could be produced. Wow. and growing yeah. the economy and creating income. So let's not we, work, Sean. Okay, let's just hang around, watch TV, play video run. games, have a joint. Let's not work. How dumb is that? I got to go. Larry Kudlow, thank you. Hey, Sean Hannity here. Hey, click here to subscribe to Fox News' YouTube page and catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis. You will not get it anywhere else.